Welcome back, Country Vet Living. Today, try and do some smelting. Got my little setup out here. Got lead wheel weights. And a cast iron pot. That's a single cast iron burner. Got it hooked up with a regulator. 20 pound barbecue grill propane bottle. I like using these. I get them filled for usually around 10 to 13 dollars. Don't mind all the rest of the monk junk. Got quite a mess out here today. Yeah, that's steel. That won't be. Got this lovely chunk of lead I found. Even more wheel weights, mostly. Ball bearing, I don't know how that got in there. I found this little off the beaten path. gas station that was still selling lead sinkers so those will get tossed in there yes shotgun slugs I don't know if these are lead or not there's some kind of wheel weight that gets taped to the inside of the wheel we'll find out won't we Maybe. It's, uh, I'll try and show you here. Very heavy, overcast rain possible. For any of you that don't know, you don't smelt lead in the rain. A single drop of water will make your pan of lead. I won't explode, I guess, is the only word for it. The lead is so hot that it tries to vaporize the water so fast that it actually causes an explosion sending molten lead all over, which is a bad thing. That's why I haven't fired it up yet. I'm waiting to see if it's going to rain or not. Hopefully not. I'd like to get all this melted down over here in my other bucket. I have buckets everywhere. little luck this is what we'll be making one pound ingots I do have some half pound ingots as well so my leads getting quite low so I'd like to get some more ingots made I don't I'll be using this to make cast bullets. I'm still not sure on the YouTube rules for this yet, so I don't know if I'll be showing you that part or not. Oh, also made a trip to the local shooting range. Some 410 shells and hulls, I guess. A lot of other. I pick it all up. I mostly go there for the lead and sometimes the brass. And you can go back and watch my uh, range scrap finds. There's two of them. I'll be doing another one soon. So, all right. Well, that'll do it for this one. There might be a part two. Depends on the weather. Thanks for visiting Country Vet Living. This is Scooter. I'll see you next time.